A Fox Valley business has found itself in some pretty hot water. That's after numerous complaints are filed with the Better Business Bureau. Local 5's Wendy Fleury is live now with the latest. Good morning, Wendy. Hey guys, good morning to you. Yes, it's all over this Greenville consignment shop. The complainants all saying they signed contracts with the store owner to get their stuff sold, but now they're not getting paid. Mitch Lundgaard says he's been duped. After posting his dining table, china hutch, and bar stools on Craigslist, he was contacted by this store, Unique Interiors and Consignment. He said uh, he would sell the stuff in his store. That way people aren't coming to my house to, to hassle me for it. Um, and he would mark it up and take the difference, guarantee me what I listed it for. However, even though the consignment shop was able to sell Mitch's merchandise, he didn't get the money promised. Every person that he seems to have dealt with has the same complaint that they don't get paid. Numerous complaints coming into the Better Business Bureau six this year alone. One complainant says the entire operation is a scam. The BBB giving this business a grade F rating. We're urging anybody who has had a bad experience with this company or any company, you know, if they're not finding a resolution on their own, please come to the Better Business Bureau's website and file a complaint with us. It will help, you know, um, warn other people of bad business practices, so it's always a good idea to start with the Better Business Bureau. We went to the consignment shop to confront the owner, Ken Seacash. Although he wasn't there, he did call us back. I have been overwhelmed since I've opened this. I, never, I, I, I didn't want to do this from day one, ma'am. And I got talked into doing this by another lady. And I got in over my head, and it's too much for me to handle. But I'm not running from anybody. I've been keeping it open. I've been striving to try to keep try to keep things afloat. Now, since we contacted the owner of Unique Interiors and Consignment, he has paid Mitch the full amount due. However, the Better Business Bureau feels there are still victims out there. If you are a victim, I would love to hear from you. Please send me an email. I posted all of the information on our website, wearegreenbay.com. Live in Greenville, I'm Wendy Fleury, Local 5 This Morning. Thank you, Wendy. Still to come here.